When we do Botox, we use an injection. It's a tiny baby needle that we use to inject this purified protein into the muscle that causes the muscle to relax and the creases to stop forming. Now when we use Botox, we're not trying to prevent all movement. We're just trying to relax the creases. There's still movement in the face. It's just not as obvious as it used to be. What I'm gonna do is give her what I call a little Botox brow lift. And what that does is, with the injections that I put in, it gives her just a little medial lift right there. Nothing scary, nothing Spock-like, nothing surprising. Just a nice relaxed forehead. We're also gonna put a little bit right around her eyes. That's gonna prevent the crow's feet from getting deeper. Another injection here. We're just putting a little bit in for her. She doesn't need a whole lot. We want to preserve some of her movement. And then what we do over here on the lateral side is we just give her a tiny bit, just about two units. And before I do the eyes, I always make sure I get a nice fresh new needle to make sure she feels nothing in that area. And this numbing obviously is helping her quite a bit. To kind of pinch the skin here, just give her a little tiny injection right into that area. And by pinching the skin, I'm able to take away a lot of the sensation, so the patients barely feel anything. Are you feeling a lot right now, Kendra? Not at all. Good. You did beautifully. Mm -hmm. Now, with Botox, it takes three to seven days to kick in, and she'll notice in, in about a week that these little lines that she's had up here and that little crow's feet that she's starting to develop just gradually fade away. Botox lasts anywhere from three to four months, and our patients often come back on a regular basis to make sure they keep up with their Botox. Thanks for watching today.